Hello, and welcome to episode two of Electric, the Ellsworth Audiogram capsule series, where we're talking about some of the latest innovative products in lithium ion battery manufacturing. We've teamed up with one of our key suppliers, HB Fuller, an innovator and leader in the battery manufacturing chemical space. Today, I'm speaking with business development manager, Anna Epley, and our focus topic is protection. Welcome, Anna. Thanks, Nina. Happy to be here today. So to start, what are some of the main challenges battery manufacturers are facing when designing lithium ion batteries from a protection standpoint? So that's a great question. You know, commonly what comes up when we're talking to our customers from a protection standpoint are three things, crash integrity, occupant and first responder safety, and fire prevention. So it's no secret that batteries are dangerous, right? The challenge that we commonly come across when talking to our customers is how do we improve the performance, such as increased range, but also how do we make sure that it's as safe as it possibly can be, with safety being the absolute number one priority? Yes, of course. What products does HB Fuller offer to address these issues? All of our protection products fall within our EV Protect line, and we have two options, both a foaming and a non-foaming option. Both are two-part polyurethane encapsulants, and the foaming products fall under the EV Protect 4006 and EV Protect 5006. These are liquid applied, lightweight, flame retardant foams that are designed to impact the entire module. And then we also have the EV Protect 300, which is perfect for customers who are not as concerned with weight reduction. And we see that a lot in the agricultural segment, for example. Nice to have different options. How do these products work exactly? For this question, I'll focus on the EV Protect foams which is the EV Protect 4006 and the EV Protect 5006. This material is a patented technology within HB Fuller. And what happens is, is when one cell within the battery is triggered, the flame retardant property consumes all the oxygen and forms a char layer or a dead layer around the cell, which prevents it from moving from one cell to the next. That technology in and of itself is what prevents the thermal propagation. Thank you. Such a great innovation to the market. What are the options if someone wants to validate this material? We're committed to helping customers get up and running and supporting them through the entire design and validation process. Many of our customers fall into the startup segment and rely heavily on our technical expertise and lab support during that design phase. We're available to support on-site if that's preferred. We can send in kits of the material as well for them to hand mix and pot the modules themselves. Or we've even had customers send in their modules to our labs where we pot with production type equipment and can run validation testing and send them back a lab report. It's really what works best for the customer. And so far, we've had a lot of success just working hand in hand with all the Ellsworth ESRs to coordinate what works best. Yes, and I can speak from personal experience that Ellsworth and HB Fuller has such great synergy in this marketplace that we really partner together and show up for our customers in the way that works best for them. Thanks everybody for joining episode two of our electric audiogram series, which was on protection. To learn more, contact your local Ellsworth representative and be sure to stay tuned for our next episode, which will be all about EV seal.